Matrices. Matrices are all about what I like to call mini tables. So here is a matrix that we'll work with today. Okay. This is a what's called a three by four matrix. Okay. Rows by columns. So there are three rows. Rows go across. And there are four columns which go down. Okay, and that's called the order of this matrix. It's a three by four matrix. To find any given value in a matrix, you can be asked to find, for example, A to one. Okay, so if this was matrix A and you were looking for number two one, then you go in the second column, sorry, second row, first column. Second row, first column. Okay, so A21 is actually the value 3. If we were chasing A32, uh, that would be the third row, the second, so that would be value 0. So how do you actually create a matrix? So here is a, a map or a drawing or, or something, and we would draw a matrix out of that, or we can draw a matrix out of that, but we have an interim table in the meantime. So we draw up a table like this, right? And we talk about, so I'm just gonna talk about how many roads there are from each point. So from A to A, there is this one here. From A to B, there is only one as well. And from B to A, the same. From A to C, there are two roads. And from C to A, the same. From A to D, there are actually no roads. So now we keep going from B to B, there are none. From B to C, there is just the one. From B to D, there is two. B to D. Um, from C to C, there are none. From C to D, there are three and the same backwards. And from D to D, there are none. So there's a table. From there, we can create a matrix. One zero one two two one zero three zero two three zero. So there we have our matrix from that diagram. 